Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Destiny, I'm Death From Above. We've got another fun gun for you today. We're looking at The Devil You Know. Now this is a year one legendary hand cannon that could that you could get from the Vanguard vendor or you could get it to drop out of Vanguard packages. And the reason I'm looking at it is because on April 12th, this gun is going to make a valiant return. And I say valiant because I love this gun. It's one of the only hand cannons I can use and still can use. You'll be watching some gameplay I recorded while playing with it for like the first time in months. But uh, I've been holding on to this since the beginning. And I thought I would do an updated Legendary Max video on the gun before it comes out in, uh, in April, on, April, on April 12th. So if we take a look at the stats for the Devil You Know from Planet Destiny, it has... A rate of fire of 22, impact of 81, range of 25, stability 42, reload 33, mag size is 12, but mine is only at 10 because I have send it. It gives me decreases carried ammo capacity. Really, that's new. I don't remember seeing that. Um, aim assist is 81, equip spree is 45, recoil direction 95, and zoom is 15. Now, if we compare that to something like the Fate Bringer. You'll see that the Fatebringer stats are pretty similar. Uh, Fatebringer has uh, pretty much it has more range on the Fatebringer, but, but send it on mine makes mine pretty much the same, if not better. Stability is a little bit less on the Fatebringer, so the Devil You Know has better stability. And with Zen Moment, it makes the stability really, really good. Aim assist on the Devil You Know is pretty high at 81 compared to 61 on the Fatebringer. Equip speed, equip speed, re recoil direction, and zoom, all. About the same. The equip speed is pretty fast on the devil, you know, though. So it's a very good gun. I, I mean, it's like a faster, better Fate Bringer, in my opinion. If it had those Fate Bringer talents, <clears throat> it would be very, very similar to the Fate Bringer. So let's take a look at my devil, you know, so you can see what it's got, <clears throat> and then we'll talk about gameplay performance, PVE, and PvP performance. So my devil, you know, has the True Sight IS, Fast Draw IS, and Quick Draw IS. I leave it on the True Sight to get the extra stability. But it has Zen Moment, Field Scout, Single Point Sling, Send It, and Crowd Control. I'm really, really hoping when the Year 2 version comes out, <clears throat> April 12th, I can get one with this same exact roll. Because this gun is beyond magical in the Crucible. We'll talk about that in a minute. So, uh, <clears throat> Zen Moment's great. You get that hit and you can just, the gun doesn't even move from where you fired it. Uh, crowd control is good for getting multiple targets. This hand cannon, it's got, an, it's got a big enough mag where you can get multiple targets. And send it gives you that increased range and accuracy. Um, makes the, it harder to handle and it decreases the ammo capacity. Um, I don't really notice. Ten, 10 rounds of the mag is still plenty big enough for me. If it had 12 rounds, that would be even better. <clears throat> Maybe uh, flip it out to single point sling if you really, really want to. If you're using it with something else. I know I was using it with... The Thessin FR4 fusion rifle having some fun. So let's get into gameplay. Talk about performance. <clears throat> I really enjoy this hand cannon. I mean, there's a reason I've kept it around since year uh, year one vanilla Destiny. I think I, I don't know if this was the vendor version or the version I got out of an Ingram or a package or something. But all I know is a solid, solid gun. It's one of the few hand cannons, like I said, that I can use. That's fun for me. Uh, I just threw it on this morning. Went into a rumble match and I, I won the rumble match by a decent margin. With uh, this, the fusion rifle and the rocket launcher, so it's a very, very strong hand cannon that I really enjoy. Um, PVE performance, it's very good. The mag size is big enough, the impact is high enough where you're, you're headshotting things to death. Any lower level enemy, you're going to body shot to one shot, no problem because of the high impact. Uh, headshotting with the Zen moment and the, uh, the crowd control for large groups of enemies makes this pistol very strong. I mean, it's a solid performer in PVE. Uh, I'm definitely going to give it an A in PvE. I've enjoyed it in PvE for a long time. If hand cannons get a little bit better ever again, this gun will be... I don't know. It can, it can only go up. Um, as far as PvP performance goes, which is what you're going to be watching, um, very solid. Just the best hand cannon I think I've ever used in PvP that wasn't the last word. <laughs> Top hand cannon that isn't the last word. We go with the devil you know. So, I mean, it's just... It's got good... You know, the aim assist is high. It feels good to use. The recoil is not out of control. It's not hard to handle. Mag size is big enough. Uh, the talents really help mine out with the Zen moment and the crowd control, though, and send it. So range is good. I mean, it's just it's a quick hand cannon that's that's easy to handle, and I find I have success with. So I'm really liking it. I've always liked it, like I said. 
but uh, solid A, A plus, or not A plus, but just A and A and PVP. Um, I mean, there's a reason I kept it this long. It's an A in both categories, so solid A. These are these are the guns that I love. So, what do you guys think? Did you keep your year one double? You know, did you? I know a lot of people had the. Uh, what was that new monarchy hand cannon from Vanilla Destiny that everybody had that was awesome? I can't remember the name of it, but anyway, that was kind of a competitor to the devil you know. I think it might have been a little bit better if you got the right talents, but it was really good. Um, but anyway, what do you guys think? What year one guns are you excited for coming back, and what year one gun did you keep? Like, what gun do you have hanging out in your vault that's just like your trophy piece, like my devil you know and my shadow price are? So... I'm going to get out of here. Thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. Leave a like if you've enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you want to see more of my videos. I am Death from Above, and I'm out. See you, bye.